And you see, that's the thing. Like, you know, like a lot of people see it. They see the situation now. You know what I'm saying? And then they, they, they look at it like they can't really. They don't have like a full view of like everything that's transpired. And see, that's the thing. Like what you're seeing now is not like real accurate, you know, because, you know, during the course of these years, I didn't even know like the specifics of like what was happening with my work. I didn't know none of this. Like everybody else probably knew, but I was like completely colluded. Like whoever was doing it, they cleaned up real nice. And that's what I was saying. Like I had no idea, no clear, I mean, no clear understanding of view. Like I, I, I didn't suspect the thing. I knew people was looking at me sideways in everyday life, but I did not know. And then I knew all the violence and stuff was happening to me without a cause. You know, I'm, I'm pretty much a church boy, you know, and, and all this happening to me. I'm doing everything about law abiding citizen everything right you feel me as long as i've been grown you know what i'm saying even as a child you know I mean so it's like the whole time i didn't understand like what was happening with my stuff i didn't know the details of the situation you feel me and then now it's like okay these or this person plays a thing are responsible for what's happening to your life or your persecution of jesus christ i mean your persecution or the persecution of the work of jesus christ in your life and, you know, um, also just the wrongful hate crime that's been against you all these years. You know what I'm saying? Even since childhood days. And, you know, it's like, okay, now that people saying that, okay, people placing things doing this. At the time when I'm posting my testimony and all this, I didn't know this stuff. I didn't know who it was. And nobody was telling me who it was. But now it's like somehow through some kind of like, I don't know, carefully, perfectly premeditated plan, time and history or whatever. It's like. Everybody's saying, or, or most of society is like saying, okay, these, these, you know, these people place a thing, this now, or people, or whatever influences that, you know, they're responsible for this, okay? Okay, they're they pretty much telling me, they sit me down, you know, me, a, a servant of God, you know, um, God who is a divine entity, a divine being, you know, child of God, you know, this is what they're telling me, like, unanimously, like, in a way, they're like saying, okay, this now, these people place a things, or whatever, influence, whatever, they're responsible for everything that's happened to you. They will not, you know, have any type of punishment or consequences for it. What are you going to do about it? That's basically what they're doing. And see, you know what I mean? And I'm, I'm 100% blameless this whole time. You know, I got, I got thousands, thousands of viral testimonials and real-time events, you know, as these things are happening year-round. And so, you know, I'm, I'm, I mean, there's no excuse why. So it's like, you know, pretty much that's what society is doing. It's like I'm literally just a modern day version of crucifixion. They're crucifying me right now, you know, in plain sight. You feel me? There's even people who say they, they love God, but they're also in on it too. You feel me? So, I mean, that's what's happening. You know what you're seeing, like, as a full perspective of it, is you're seeing like a modern day, you know, crucifixion of a, of a, of a servant of Jesus Christ. That's what's going on. And like a wide scale situation That's why And you know And and That's what it is So you're saying People saying You know These people doing it So that it's pretty much Sitting me down Asking me like What I'm going to do about it You know what I'm saying Like they, they will not get Any kind of punishment For anything they've done There's Thousands of counts of Murder You know extortion you know, you know All types of different things And you know They're going to be I mean that's just how it is You're saying that The, the, the value of a servant of God Means nothing you know, in this country, that's what's being said. So it's like, well, I mean, at the end of the question, that's a good question. What am I gonna do? And you know, I mean, my answer is trust in the Lord. You know, that's what I've been doing this whole time. No reason to change it now. You know, just like me writing my poetry for the Christians and you know, people that love God. No reason to change it now. I've been doing this since I started writing. No reason to change it now. If so, according, I mean, I started under the principles that were under. The, um, you know the laws and standards and structures of the land now for any reason that they've changed then they've changed just because of my my embracement of Christianity that makes no sense in a place that's under God why would things change you know what I'm saying to incorporate a crime a religious hate crime against a follower of Christ we show that that's impossible for any place that's Christian you know what I'm saying that just that's just basic common sense like and so that's the situation. So, but you under, get a better understanding, you know, of like biblical history and the Bible and everything, you know what I'm saying? Even from this point in time on, you know what I'm saying? Because you can see an example of what's happening and how the Lord, you know, the cross is being absolutely renounced, humiliated, mocked, you know, absolutely tore down by like a wide, or, you know, a wide array of society, you know, a majority of society, you know, is, is chiding, mocking, 
you know, renouncing, defiling, humiliating the cross of Jesus as we speak in real time. You know what I'm saying? On wide scales. And that's what's happening. You're seeing it. You know what I'm saying? It's just they don't have no label on it. Like saying that this is what's happening in, in flesh and lights. No, it's not saying that, you know, like in a, in a you know what I'm saying, in a giant billboard or something is telling you this is what's not. But that's what's happening, though. You feel me? If you pay attention with spiritual discernment, you know, through the Holy Ghost, you'll notice that that's what's going on. The Lord is being persecuted. You know what I'm saying? Because people can look at my stuff and they can see what I'm standing for and what I've been standing for since 2013, all the way to now. So, I mean, you mean you can make your decision about but That's what. So, I mean, that's pretty much what's going on, like, you know, full view of the perspective. Yeah.